the Gotthard Massif in the Swiss Alps, obstacle between north and south. For more than 130 years, trains have traveled through spiral tunnels that climb some 600 meters up to the tunnel portals at Göschenen and Airolo. The historic north-south link, a pioneering achievement by the railway builders of the 19th century. But for the railway through the Gotthard, a new era will soon begin. In the future, the trains will travel beneath the Alpine Massif on a route with minimal gradients and generous wide radius curves. The Gotthard Base Tunnel is the world's longest tunnel. Together with the Chenery Base Tunnel, it will make the flat route through Switzerland reality and a component of the European high-speed network. Passenger trains traveling at up to 250 kilometers an hour will shorten the journey time between Zurich and Milan to less than three hours. 1998, the Swiss people say yes to the new rail link through the Alps, or NRLA for short. That means yes to transferring goods traffic from the roads to the railways. Yes to a flat route under the Alps and a clear commitment to a modern, forward-looking transport policy. For 11 years, the tunnelers bored and blasted two 57-kilometer-long tubes through the mountains. In 2010, they celebrate the breakthrough of the Gotthard Base Tunnel. A big day for Switzerland and Europe. It's now the turn of the railway infrastructure specialists to work round the clock on the Gotthard Base Tunnel, to equip the tubes with state-of-the-art railway systems. The gigantic construction project will soon be complete. Farther south between Bellinzona and Lugano, the second section of the flat route is taking shape, the Chenery Base Tunnel, 16 kilometers long, the second major construction project of the NRLA on the Gotthard route. The work is proceeding at full speed. The first trains will travel through here in 2019. The tunnels cannot operate without approach routes. In some places, virtually the entire traffic infrastructure of roads and railways must be completely rebuilt. Bridges, underpasses, roundabouts, roads and embankments. Only by doing so can the tunnels be integrated into the railway network. The headquarters of Alp Transit Gotthard Limited in Lucerne. Everything comes together here. As the construction principal, Alp Transit Gotthard Limited controls and supervises the construction, costs, standards and deadlines of the Gotthard and Chenery base tunnels. The new rail link through the Alps is truly the heart of Switzerland's forward-looking transport policy. And with the Gotthard base tunnel, the world's longest railway tunnel is being constructed. So we're building a world record. The new rail link through the Alps is Switzerland's biggest ever environmental protection project, not only because of transferring traffic from road to rail, but also because we're attempting to give something back to nature. For example, by creating new habitats for plants and animals, or returning streams and rivers to nature. When trains start to travel through the Gotthard and Chenery base tunnels, a new era of transalpine transport will begin. We're building the future.